What's up guys, this is Andrew at night and today I'm going to show you how to make your own Android 3D live wallpaper. Now this is the effect that we are going for. You can see the icons seem to be floating over the, uh, over the wallpaper and this is achieved using two different effects. The first one is a Musi style um, blurring of the wallpaper. If you look, you can see the wallpaper is nowhere near as sharp as it would normally be and rather than actually detracting from the look, this makes the icons sort of stand out even more. And then on top of that, we've got a 3D parallax effect, which is what's creating that look, where it almost looks as if the icons are floating above the wallpaper. The, um, the widgets also do this, as you can see here. So the whole effect, the whole thing appears to be floating. The first app you're gonna need to achieve this effect is called Tholitis, and I've done a video on this before. You wanna open up your app and choose um, whichever image you wanna use. I'm going to hit current wallpaper and that will open up the one that I've already edited. You can see you've got a blur option and a dim option and as you move each along it gives you a live preview of what it's going to look like. I've got mine set something already so I'm not actually going to save this new one but you hit save and then you can set it as your wallpaper. So when you've blurred and dimmed your image using Tholitis you want to go back to your home screen, hit wallpapers and choose 3D parallax live wallpaper. Then if you go into settings, if you go down here to background layer, you want to hit that and then go into your gallery and then go into your Tholitis folder and I'm going to choose the top one there, hit done and then that sets it um, as your background. I then also suggest you go down to 3D tilt level and drop it all the way to the left and then do the same thing with a 2D transition level. If you do that it tends to make the effect look that little bit better, um, it doesn't go too far left, too far right too far up and down and if you do have it like that it looks kind of loose and a little bit laggy if you set them like that the whole effect gets that little bit tighter seems to look a bit better and then you hit back and then hit set wallpaper and that is how you can get this 3d effect on your home screen the launcher i've been using in this video is nova launcher and the icon pack is lumos and i'll stick links to both of those in the description i am going to get some matte screen shields just so this isn't quite as reflective but i think it works kind of well i just need to make sure to keep the phone at a bit of an angle at the moment but i hope you get the full idea of what this wallpaper looks like so uh, yeah give it a go yourself guys if you want some cool icon packs to twin with this effect i'm going to be doing a top 10 icon pack video either today or maybe tomorrow so i'll have that up within the next couple of days um, and you can find a nice icon pack to go along with this effect but any questions please comment below if there's anything else you'd like to see please also comment below and i'll see you guys in the next video